Hi, in this video I'm just going to show you how you can slow down or speed up a clip in both the track cutter and the mixing screen and how you can reverse play um, the whole mix or just a segment of the mix. So here I'll just double click on the piece of video that I want to play in. Here it's an athletics race. And here when I click play you'll see the race. So there's the race. Now if I wanted to slow down this race, I can just go to the adjust play rate pot and just slowly bring it down. So I'm bringing it down to 30 BPMs. And now when I click play, you can see that the race is now playing in slow motion. If I only want to just do the video and not the audio, I can always just highlight it to make holding down the shift key to make a selection box and then I can just highlight the video so click play there and you can see that it's going in slow motion now I can slow that down even more by just highlighting the adjust play rate deleting it and setting in a new one so let's say something like 15 or even 10 So now this is going to play extremely slow. So you, you've got control about how slow or how fast you want it. Now what I could do is I could copy and paste that and place it into the mixing screen. And now the race that I just watched is now in slow motion. So I'm just going to delete this and in the track cutter I'm just going to restore the video to its original speed so you just click on the restore to original temp tempo button so it's back to its normal speed there and I'll just make a quick selection holding on the shift key and the keyboard and, ho and holding on the left button of my mouse and I'll just copy and paste this in so I can actually then speed up and slow down the clip while it's in the in the mixing screen as well by just clicking on the segment properties brings up the segment prop properties of that clip and here I've got another adjust rate pot that I can slow down or speed up so I'm going to speed this up and again when I click play you can see the video is playing fast so I can even click back to the race you can go back to the beginning of the race and you can see the race is now playing very very fast I'll just show you that again and again you can you can make it even faster by highlighting it highlighting it in the tempo field and maybe bring it up to seven. And you can see it's playing very, very fast. You can see here that it's relooped because it's now much, much faster than the original clip, so I can just bring that back and the indents will tell me where the clip actually ends these indents here will show me this is the end of the clip so as you can see now I'm playing the clip in very fast motion again if I want to restore the clip to its original size I just click on the restore original tempo button and then I just stretch it out to its original size again the indents will tell me where the end of the clip is so there we go and, and that little red marker there also tells me I'm at the end so now I want to do something like play the clip in reverse again I'm in the segment properties here and I can just click on the play in reverse button now this video will play in reverse in the mixing screen so I'll just click play and you can see there's Usain Bolt running backwards So you can control how fast and how slow a clip can play and you can also also control uh, playing a clip in reverse. Um, I hope this helps and if you've got any questions please don't hesitate to contact us on the forum we'll get back to you straight away. Okay thanks very much bye bye.